everyone happy new year welcome to 2016 it's kim q here a hundred percent dedicated to helping you build your business and your brand without losing too much of your money or your mind so listen guys i had to come on over here i just did a periscope and it went kind of long so i had to do a shorter version for my youtube peeps okay for my video peeps um but i was really talking about the fact of whether or not well the question i should say whether or not you are the real deal or you are a con artist and I want you to think about this because this is not about my company. It's about whatever company or business you are in. Are you a product of the products? Okay, not just one product. Because some people say, yeah, I'm a product of the product. And they're only using the one flagship product that everybody knows about. Like I know in my company, it's horrible. But there are some reps, some distributors who claim to be in the business. And they only use the one product that everyone knows about. They don't use any of the more than 30 other products we have. Well, I'm not like that. I let people know that I use the products. Here's how it tastes. Here's how it made me feel. I I heard this person got this result with that product. That wasn't my experience. My experience is that I got this result. I tell them whether or not I'm happy with that result. Whatever the case may be, okay? Because everybody's body is different. In case you don't know, I'm in a health and wellness company. And with health and wellness, people tend to get real stingy with their money and real touchy with their feelings. If somebody else lost 10 pounds with a product, they want to lose 10 pounds with a product or more. But if they lose less, then they're like, I don't know. So I feel like it's very, very, very important that you let people know that you're not asking them to do anything that you're not doing. Okay, and you give them realistic expectations. Hey, you may have this uh, feeling, you may have um, that feeling. Somebody said it did this for them. Another person said it did that for them. But let me tell you something. It is important that you let them know from the horse's mouth. Hey, I have the product here in my house and here's what it did for me. And come along with my journey. People love that. Okay. I tried this product. I'm going to do a totally separate commercial for it. So check that out on my YouTube channel. But I tried this product for the first time. It's a new product for my company. I tried it for the first time last night. And I posted on my Facebook today. Letting everybody know. Hey listen. Yes. I went from 181 at the beginning of the year. 2015. And I dropped down to 157 in June. But I have not. I kind of slacked off on my journey. I have not reached my goal of being just under 150. So I put this post on my Facebook page y'all and I was basically telling them oh I hope you can see it I'm gonna include the link to my Facebook page but I was basically telling them hey listen I am starting operation fine by Valentine and I am finally going to get below 150 if you can see I show a picture of the scale today January 1st 2016 and I show a picture of me holding the product and I give a little blurb to tell them about this new product that um I'm going to be adding to that I've added to my regimen to get me to that goal weight. OK, let me tell you something, people. People want to be on a journey with you. OK, they want to be a part of something. They want to come back to your social media and click and say, where is she at today? Where is he at today? Has it gone up? Has it gone down? And they want to know that you are doing what you want them to do. Since I put that post up, I have had a lot of activity. You hear my phone, my, not my phone, my computer going. Doo -doo 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 -doo. That's people inboxing me going, hey, what is this about? Hey, how does that work? Haven't seen that product before. Do you have any more besides that? And so you want to get, if you really want to get activity, guys, going into the new year, don't just put up product pictures that say what the product technically is. Put up pictures of you with the product and then do a video about what the product does, okay? Nobody cares that this has L-Arginine in it. They don't even know what that is. Half the people in my company don't even know what that is. They're walking around pronouncing it L-Argentina, <laughs> okay? But what does L-Arginine do? Well, if you want to know, you got to go watch the commercial that I'm about to record and put on my YouTube channel that, where I will tell you what it does. But I'm just telling you that, you know, stop advertising the product. Buy my product, buy my product, buy my product, buy my product. And instead, invite people along on the journey of weight loss or feeling better or looking better with you and say, hey, I got this product. Here's what it's supposed to do. I started using it XYZ day. Come along with me. Buy yours now, too, and let's go on this journey together. Doesn't that sound a lot better than buy my product, buy my product, buy my product? People are going to be like unfriend, block, delete, unfollow. They don't want to hear that, okay? 
So guys, don't be a con artist. Show people that your word is your bond, that you're out there using the products too, that you have faith in your company and in and, and your whatever service product you have and that you're willing to put your money where your mouth is. If you want them to buy it, you better buy it. And then tell everyone that you bought it and share your experience, okay? I hope you find this video helpful. If you do, you know what to do give me that thumbs up and i love these comments that i've been getting recently definitely share this video let your team know that they need to be a product of the product if you have a team and you're not spreading this message you're shooting yourself in the foot because you should be getting paid on the volume not just from the customers but also not just from the external customers but the internal customers as well your entire team needs to be trying every single product in every product line of your company that it has to offer okay all right um so guys, subscribe to the channel too, so that when I do these videos, you're the first to know. All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye.